seven people, including children, go missing in the Cherokee National Forest tonight. They are safe, but still not out of the woods yet. Good evening. I'm Kim Chapman. And I'm Josh Rowe. They got lost deep in the woods right around the Tennessee Georgia state line. The main area where crews are trying to get the family out is at the Rice Camp Trailhead, which is in Murray County, Georgia. And Lawrence joins us now live to tell us how they get lost and what it took to find them. Hannah. Josh and Kim, last we heard, those crews are still working to get the families out of the woods. We had to come out of the forest just to get some cell phones serviced in order to do this live shot. That's one of the major challenges that they've had doing this search today. Zach Harry worried endlessly about his wife and these little boys lost overnight in the Cherokee National Forest. He's been out here since, looking for them with aggressive search crews. I really do appreciate them. I mean, no more. Another family of four was on the hike yesterday too. Zach says he split off from the group when the kids started getting tired. He was going to bring the truck around to meet them all at the end of a closer trailhead. I waited to about maybe nine o'clock last night, waited on them, and nobody ever, um, nobody ever showed. That's when he made the call to police and his father. I couldn't understand him at first when he called me. He said that his family was, uh, you know, lost in the wilderness. After after nearly 15 hours of searching, officers say a chopper spotted the group near the river. At the time, officers believed everyone in the group looked okay. As Zach waited for his family to be brought out, he had a hard time putting his emotions into words. I, I couldn't explain it. He says this incident won't keep him from hiking again, but he will do one thing differently. I'll never leave him again, I'll tell you that. Of the children that are in the woods, the oldest is 11 years old, the youngest is four years old. We are in touch with the family and will let you know as soon as they are all out safely. Reporting live in Bradley County, Hannah Lawrence, News Channel 9. Hannah, thank you. And with the warmer weather now out there now, it is the perfect time to remind everyone to have a plan in place if you go out and enjoy the outdoors. Country music stars are coming together to help raise.